Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com, and I'm here to show you how to play our game Math Boat Rounding to the Nearest Ten. Um, this is one of the games featured on MathNook.com, and if you're not fam familiar with our site, we have uh, plenty of free math games to play, as well as other fun logic and puzzle games. So let's go ahead and get started on the video, and when you first start up the game, you have the options of actually starting the game or seeing how to play, so let's go ahead and click how to play and you can see we have the instructions here in case you forget how to play uh, after watching the video. Let's go ahead and click back and let's go ahead and click start game. Now here's a game field and if we wanted to start we'd go ahead and click this right here but let's go ahead and look and see what we got on the screen here. Here's your boat and what you're going to do is the object of the game is to get all of the life preservers here little life rings there and then once you do there will be a parking uh, place that will show up and you'll need to drive the boat there and you'll move on to the next level once you do so. Uh, you can also get extra points by running over these little coins here and that will uh, add to your score. So to control the boat you have these arrows here with numbers in them. So what I'm going to do is when I start up I'm going to let the boat go forward and I'm going to let it, I want to hit this ring over here so when we reach about here I'm going to go ahead and have the number that uh, the left arrow rounds to to the nearest ten so I'm going to go ahead and put uh, 50 in here and then when I go ahead and put that in a little bit earlier and then when I reach here this point with the boat I'll hit the enter key I can click here enter or I can just hit the enter key on my keyboard and the boat will go left continue down here I'm going to go ahead and make it go down here then over hit this ring that you can barely see there and once I do then a parking uh, the parking spot will show up so let's go ahead and sh I'll show you how it works I'm going to go ahead and click it to start and I'm going to want to go left in a minute so 49 rounds to 50 I'm going to go ahead and plug in 50 and when it gets there where I want I'm going to go ahead and click that enter going left the next direction I'm going to want to go is down so the down arrow has 13 in it and that rounds to 10 and go ahead and hit enter there next I'm going to go right and uh, the right arrow has 29 in it that rounds to 30 and about time to go right now I'm not exactly sure where the parking spots gonna show up I think it's about here but it may vary I say okay now I'm gonna need to go up 48 rounds to 50 go ahead and put that in and it should it's got to get in between these four marks there it should make it and we're done with that level now the next level has a little obstacle in there that you need to avoid another little obstacle let's go ahead and start now I'm gonna go ahead and finish up the game here so I'm gonna make it run into the side here 71 will make it go right if I round that to 7 that rounds to 70 and gonna crash real quick and go ahead and click to start I'll go ahead and plug in 60 to make it go right and it cracks again and I think this should be the yes there's one I have one life left so go ahead and click start 76 rounds to 80 go ahead and plug 80 in hit enter and the game should be over at this point and you get uh, an option to try again if you click try again you're able to enter your name in the high score table I'm gonna go ahead and key in Tommy if you don't want to do that you can hit the little X here and I'll go to the next screen but I'm gonna go ahead and submit that and it shows how I did right there um, oh well, that's a score right there that's from me playing earlier and once you're through with that look at the high score table uh, if there's more than what fits on the screen you can use the uh, up and down arrows here to scroll through more high scores. Let's go ahead and close that out. And the next screen is an email challenge and this is where if you want to brag about your high score to your friends or just show somebody how well you did you can actually plug in uh, the high plug in our email address and click submit and they will get a challenge telling them where to come play the game and what your score was. If you don't want to do that you can always click X and you'll be back uh, 
to the main menu where you can restart the game or see the instructions again. Hope you uh, liked this video. Hope it helped and, and have fun playing. Thanks.